Welcome to the Maxim Foods Inside Track. We'll start things off with full cream milk powder. Full cream milk powder pricing has remained very resilient, uh, especially coming into the start of the New Zealand season. Global demand has been quite strong, so we'll continue to see firm pricing through to 2020. It's important to note that Australian full cream milk powder is in very short supply. Uh, Australian milk, as you know, is down. So a lot of the manufacturers are channeling that milk into other higher earning ingredients or value adds. Moving across to butter, like whole milk powder, it was quite a flat result on the GDT last Tuesday night. Um, as previously discussed in, in other editions, the European butter pricing has moved up to the same level of oceanic pricing now. So I believe with a flat season again in New Zealand, pricing will be buoyant out till 2020. Looking at skim milk powder, skim milk powder was the biggest mover on last Tuesday's GDT, going up 2.5%. Basically, over the last month, it has shot up quite quickly. Um, global manufacturers are achieving some really good pricing on skim, so in terms of the short to medium term, pricing will remain firm. Having a look at cheese, cheese in the US is remaining quite strong in price. There's some uncertainty around uh, the EU and US trade conditions, which could see cheese even strengthen again over in the US. Across here, back home, uh, Australian cheese is, is in very low supply. We're probably predicting about 3% down in milk uh, for Australia's milk season, so there'll be less and less Australian cheese around, so we'll have to look to our partners, the Kiwis, to uh, fill that void. Finally, we'll have a look at whey and lactose. As a net position, uh, pricing is remaining pretty flat on these commodities. Uh, there's a lot of activity in China at the moment. Uh, the, the abolishment of the tariffs for US imported whey should increase demand. However, there's also the African swine flu that is really affecting demand. So it's sort of evening, evening itself out there. So we probably see flat conditions over the next three months. Thanks very much for listening, we'll see you again next time.